Masters and traps. Right out for you. every move. The new cousin Tootsie is still enjoying it. Having trouble? Nothing fucking but. One ploughing trouble after the other. What's it to you? Who are you? Geralt of Rivia. Witcher. Radovid sent me. No, oh, it's you. I've been waiting for you. Don't exactly sound delighted. Would you expect us to? We've done half the work. Now you show up and take all the glory. Word was you hadn't been able to get inside. Tell yesterday when we found this. Doesn't look like much, but it's got power of some sort. Opens the entrance. Good work. Saved me some time. We're thrilled. Think Philip is still inside? That we don't know. Only certain thing is she was there at some point. Certain? How's that? We've been after her since Loch Moin. Poking out her eyes weren't enough. Radovid should have gutted her there and then. As it is, she turned into an owl and fled. Flew across Kedwin and Redania. Then tucked herself away here. What can I expect to find inside? Everything. Anything. It's an old elven temple, the witch Isleheart turned into her hideout. Look at him. Fell into some magic trap, then monsters attacked him. Barely got out alive. Any of your men still down there? A dozen or so went in. They's all that came out. Rest are probably dead. Time I saw her, Philip is still in there. Don't count on anyone going in to retrieve your corpse. Maybe not. Maybe go to your shop. Think you'll find something. That cutthroat. <laughs> not in your life. He is a witcher. Witcher or not, you'll be dead before you can say two prayers. Beware. some mechanism that opens this door. Missing one tile. Perfect hideout for an owl. Be a bit harder for me to move around. Portals. Great. And the witch hunters probably messed with them. Works. Who would have thunk? Eight portals make my stomach turn. A remix. It's edge afraid. This is an owl feather. Mm -hmm. Neckers. Might have explained as much. Maybe I can... 
can start that. Should work now. Step closer. She that before you hurt yourself. Wait, wait, wait. You, you, you that witcher the king was supposed to send? Guessed it. You should know by now how dangerous this place is. I'll wait up above with the others. Not a chance. Those cowards ran at the first whiff of monsters. I made a stiffer stuff. Besides, something big set to happen here. I just know it. I learn what it is. Radovid will appreciate it. King will promote me. Maybe even give me a medal. What's the big event that's supposed to happen? Mm, don't know the details, but I came across Philippa Eilhart's notes. Mentioned Ida Emian, Margarita Lowe and Teal, Francesca Finderbear, and Frangela Vigo. As I see it, they aim to meet here. Think Philip is still here? Can't really know. Sure, we searched a few caverns, but in nooks abound. If someone wanted to hide in here, they could easily. Even if they weren't an owl. All right, let's get you out of here. Told you already, no chance. Besides, the teleport's power cell. I broke it off. We have to wait till they come for us. Got no choice. Nobody's gonna come for us. Give me the crystal, I'll get us out of here. But the monsters? I'll defend you. What if you can't? Be a good little hunter and give me the crystal. I am a good little hunter. There you go. Ah. Oh. Love letters. Interesting. Philip had dumped some woman for Dijkstra. Another feather. Doubt Philip had an aviary. These are signs of polymorphy. Right. Now to activate it. Feather. Doubt Philippa had an aviary. These are signs of polymorphy.
the sentry, of course. surgical instruments. Philippa operated on someone here. Notes. Charred. Almost completely. Can't read a thing. A megascope. Scorched. Covered in soot. Maybe one of the crystals survived.
Better come up and form. You're alive! Find anything? Cremated notes, a necker nest, rats. Nothing interesting. Why don't I believe you? Truth, awfully prone to suspicion, you hunters. Not without reason. Grab him! Watch his whirling!
Not swords. Show me what you have in stock. Long. 
Welcome to my workshop. Sturdy craftsmanship at a reasonable price. Show me... So long. Baptism of fire. You know what? So long.
Let's have rift the Lord of Tiberius. Leave him. Your duty. Where are you scurrying to, Rich? Let's see your pass. Pass? What pass? Kind of pass confirms you ain't no maid. Can't enter or leave Novigrad without it. Why have you shut the city gates? So's we can clean it of mages, witches, and other scum that's crawled here since the war began. Aim to catch every last one of them, toss them on a flaming pyre like poxy livestock. Sorry, don't have a pass. You'll scurry no further then. Next! Hang on, how do I get one? Start by making an offering to the church. Then you'll need three pure souls to confirm... Let him through. Here's his papers. What? But we're... Not your concern. Back to your post. Regards from Siggy Reuven. Washed your hair lately. She cast no spells. Oh, oh my honor. An elf sauna. This is the ship of His Majesty Radovid V, King of Redania. State your business. I want to see the King. It's about Philippa Eilhart. If that's the case, come with me. But no sudden moves. Got my eye on you. Witcher, any progress? Have you found Eilhart? No, I wasn't in her hideout, but I found this crystal there. If I'd wanted a shiny bauble, I would have gone to a jeweler. You were to bring me Eilhart. This is a Megascope crystal. The mages you keep in prison should be able to extract something from it. Yes. Oh, at last. They might prove useful. Not exactly what I expected, but... Very well. You've earned your pay. Now forgive me. I have affairs to which you must attend. Barbarian. Some ushers. Wonderful. That's one matter resolved. Wanted to talk about the text itself. Hmm. It's not at all badly written. In fact, 
I quite like it. I was willing to relax my standards to help Dudu, but we may have something very interesting here. I've very clear ideas who to cast as the servant, the witcher and the queen, but I'm not certain who should play the prince and the princess. Who's playing the witcher? An amateur. It'll be my first time working with him, but I'm confident he'll pull it off. Newcomer to the troupe? In a sense. Oh, stop pretending you don't know. I'm talking about you. It's a good idea. Doubt I'll get a standing ovation, but Dudu will see me. That's the key. But you will make an effort, won't you? Learn your lines, at least. I'll give it a shot, of course. So, about the princess. Small part, but an important one. Any idea who could play her? Priscilla would be the obvious choice. She's young and beautiful. Yet, I do have more stage experience. Let's have Priscilla do it. No offense, but uh, most people... Assign greater importance to appearance than to talent. I understand. I shall let her know. I'm certain she'll be wonderful. So who do you see playing the Doppler Prince? I'm finding it hard to decide between two candidates. Abelard Ritzer would be the safe bet. He's been part of our troupe for ages, has flawless technique, but he doesn't exactly captivate the crowds. Who's your other option? Maxim Bolya, outstanding actor, and audiences love him. But sadly, I can never be sure he'll show up sober, or that he'll show up at all. Let's go with Abelard. I'll take a reliable artisan over an unpredictable artist any day. Rightly so. The project is risky enough without our casting Maxim. These performances bring in much coin? Well, it varies. On good days, the square is barely capable of accommodating everyone. Other times, we're lucky to earn a handful of coppers. Of course we shall pay you a fee as well. You're a member of the ensemble now. <laughs> Thanks. Alright, got the cast figured out. It seems so. Prepared to plunge headlong into your career as a mama? We can start now. Looked over the script, out of curiosity. We can start any time, even now. Well, we've no time to lose. Come to the stage. Zoltan, what are you doing here? Pessy <laughs> told me you ought to be putting on a play. Were you playing the lead? I'm not the lead. Oh, I thought to myself, I'd sooner shave my beard than miss that. Tell me what you are. You're going to wear hose and a codpiece. Calm, Geralt. You must focus your mind before you go on stage. Good luck. Ladies and gentlemen. Most honorable citizens of the hallowed city of Novigrad, welcome. We have for you an exquisite comedy. It's titled The Doppler's Salvation. The players, Witcher Geralt as himself, Katerina as the queen, Leo Rybe as the humble servant, appearing as the prince, a veteran of the Novigrad stage, Abelard Ritza. And as the princess, the lovely Trabaritz with the voice of a nightingale, Priscilla. Majesty, the monster slayer awaits. Your summons he's answered and stands at the gates. Show him in. I must speak to the man. But first, some wine to steady my hand. <laughs> Witch.
Witcher, your task is a matter most tender. Her monster shall show a tonight's feastly splendor. Stand guard, beware, kill the beast if he shows. Your reward you'll receive on my finest pillows. To slay beasts most foul, twas for this I was made. I kill as my calling, not just to get paid. He swallowed the bait, this fool of a witcher. I'll ensure the foul bow reveals his true figure. The monster revealed, the witcher shall strike. The beast will he slay, thrust his head on a pike. Ah, oh, my child will pity her love, this beast. Though at least ere he goes, he'll enjoy a last feast. Gathered are we, a host fair and noble, to celebrate this day, the princess's betrothal. Alas, no monster do I see or hear. Perhaps midst the guests he hides in fear. My dear, Long have we hid our love's tender fires. Months we've restrained our loins' hot desires. Tonight shall it end. Be my wife, that's my plea. That having said, I'll get down on my knee. Oh, darling, I will, I will, I will. Wait, with wine must we toast this moment joyful. If not, a foul curse shall rend your lives woeful. T -t 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 Treason! Tis not wine, but a brew spiked with silver. My bowels contract a foul beast to deliver. Hark, hark, tis no prince, but a Doppler imposter. If the maid loves him, it seems we've lost her. Behold, Witcher, the beast of which I spoke. Unleash your sword, let fly the killing stroke. Stop, stop, beast or man, tis my love, my betrothed. Sheath your blades, fear a Doppler. Tis a thing most foolish. Changing one's shape does not make one ghoulish. Remember, tis not flesh a monster makes. But a heart that is base, such as in this knave, aches. Witcher, tis true. This wretch's foul suspicions tainted my mind with this plan so malicious. The Doppler must live. My daughter he'll wed. Beast or man, she loves him truly without dread. Tis our tale's end, good folk, and its moral is this. Show love for Dopplers, as well as for fish. The Witcher is just a true Doppler's friend. But you, foul page, in chains you shall end. Guard! Call the guard! Remove the traitor at once! Hey! Hear the princess's command. Come up here. Come on then, governor. Up you go. On stage. Toss the tray, I'll storm in the dungeon. Don't be afraid. In the end, everyone will live happily ever after. and princess wed the same night. 
The servant's heart melted. He wept at the sight. Jobless to the stake! Burn them all! Give it a rest, mate. Can't you see it's all in fun? This is a comedy. A ghoul could play the prince. Lighten up, for God's sake. Greetings, Dudu. Heard about that souvenir Horson left on your face. So, you know everything? Have you seen Siri? No. Still looking for her. Geralt! Masterful! You did great. Haven't they laughed that hard in ages? Lads won't believe it when I tell them. Explain one thing to me. How do you and Dandelion manage to displease Reuven, Horson, and the temple guard all at the same time. It's not as if we planned it. <laughs> I know Siri went back to Horson's to get you. How'd you manage to escape? I ran after her, wanting to keep up, but I'd have been a hindrance. She called out to me and treated me to shapeshift and disappear. I tried to find them, Siri and Dandelion. It was as if they turned to vapor. Fearing for my life, I shifted each day, becoming someone else. Even considered turning into Siri to trick her pursuers, but... Slow down, Marmalade. Hmm. Geralt, when did you last see Cirilla? Hmm? Been a while, hasn't it? A while, yeah. For me, likewise. Must be a full-grown lass by now. Do, do, do us a wee favour. Show us Siri for a moment. Geralt? No, no need. I'll recognize Siri when I see her, sure of it. Oh, uh, uh, I just thought you might want to see. Not angry with me, are you, Geralt? No. I feel relieved. And Dandelion? Were you able to find him? Witch hunters nabbed him, but there's good news too. Menga's dead. Ugh, a fiend. Good thing someone finally killed it, though another just as bad or worse would likely take its place. Wouldn't be so quick to assume. Got a feeling it could be a decent fellow. What's he talking about? We think we can free Dandelion. Just need your help. What could I do? Take on Menga's appearance. Then go and give the order for Dandelion to be moved to Oxenfurt. We'll lie in ambush in a ravine en route. Spring Dandelion from the convoy when it rolls by. Wait, not so fast. How am I to be Menga? And I've no notion where Dandelion's being held. Dandelion's on Temple Isle, imprisoned there. You'll need to find out exactly where. But what if they grow suspicious? Start asking questions. I'll bet my best axe no one will pester the commander of the temple guard. Besides, you're a Doppler and an actor, and an actor and a Doppler. Could double the spark to improvise your way out of any situation. If things get spicy, you'll just nip round the corner and transform into a buxom wench, a jackdaw, or whatever else strikes your fancy. Of course, it's that simple. Thanks. No one knows Menga's dead. No need to worry about being exposed. No one save you. Would this have anything to do with the fire at the witch hunter's barracks? We were in the area. <laughs> I sorely regret not seeing that. Listen, you'll manage. Everybody believes Menga's missing. You can make up any story you want. My lads and me will lie in ambush in the ravine. Geralt will then join us and we'll await word from you. But how am I to contact you as Menga? Send word that the convoy's left. 
You'll need to figure that out. Come on, Guile's your middle name. So, we all clear? Dudu, get your ass to Temple Isle. I'm off to assemble my crew. And we'll be waiting for you, Geralt. Yeah, see you in the ravine. Whoa, wait! Hold on, what happens after? I hope you don't expect me to continue as Menga, live like Chappelle, burning the occasional heretic to keep up appearances? No, once it's over we expect to see you at the Rosemary in time, where we'll all meet. To get pissed like wild badgers. So, settled, let's get to work. Not bad, not bad at all for your first time out. Just a few minor trip-ups. The performance in general, what did you think? I doubt the audience understood it all, but that's to be expected. I'm just pleased the Puffins got the word out. That was quite the crowd. You were right to cast Abelard as the prince. It's likely Maxim would have shown up drunk as a fish or forgotten about the premiere altogether. Here you are, your fee. I must admit your style of mumming, well, it's quite minimalist. Did you study anywhere? At Kaer Morhen. Minimum expression means maximum effect. Thanks for the coin. Take care now.